Hello and welcome. This we have the G30 5 Series full review. So another episode. Today we're gonna to do the full review. We have the G30, the G31, the bigger brother. The difference is, is this one is saloon, this one estate. As you can see from the front, the cars, they're not so different. The only things you can do, BMW giving you option to change these grills in chrome black. See, instead of original ones, to be dirty mine, never mind, it's been working. This has come a standard, this is an upgrade. You can see this one is a blue. It's called Mont Blanc blue. You can see closely, they're not so different from the front. The bar from the passenger passenger side backwards, then when they start to change the wheels, the wheels are the same. You can see the forged BMW M Sport wheels. They have this uh, for efficiency and very strong. And the other one, let's see, they come at 245 in the front and 275 in the back. Now we start to tell you the differences. You see the M logo here? So they both have beautiful aerodynamic mirrors. We've been setting, we've been sharing many seeds together, you know, since we got it. This, I believe, are the best cars you can buy for the money. You cannot find any better. Especially, if you're also a family man, then you go for this one. If you're a little bit sporty like me, Legs, cars, and stuff. We go for the saloon, a little bit lighter. So now, interior wise, and it's beautiful. I don't know how do you call it. You can see it now. He he found the name by accident. He said whiskey, and I think he's right. It's it's got the panoramic panoramic sunroof all the way to the back. So, the seats in the back are not so ju junky like mine because they fall down in case you want to carry more more luggages. So now I read something and now we have 570 liters of, uh, of cargo here. See, when the seats go down, we have 1,770 cargo that you can carry. This one comes off and you can carry the, the seats fall down nicely. They go all the way here, you see, with a, even have a button here. Whoa, look at that. That's what you get in the BMW. 1,700 is like a minivan the space but the minivan doesn't have 240 horsepower like this one has and 480 newton meters we'll talk about it in a minute so now you can see this the van doesn't do this you see so now i love this Diamond shaped exhaust. One, two. You don't need aftermarket. BMW taking care of you. And these are real, by the way. These are real. You can see this one, I believe it has more diffuser because it's, it's, it's designed for downforce. You can see here, mine is a little bit, little bit flat. This one, it's got one piece. Mine is has two pieces. 
this is one piece. There's one piece. This is where you can see. So now I heard this one is 1895. I don't, I'm not sure. 18, 18, uh, 18, 1875 as a weight kilos 1875 but because it's being remapped then how we know it's remapped now to demonstrate go inside this car you can see here we are going to keep it nice and clean everything has been done you can see here for the sun visor and now how we know it's remapped the only way you know is when you start the car you press the sport button and you go here there you go we're not lying here we're not making numbers this one says 240 horsepower and 480 newton meters of torque so if you now i'm going to demonstrate something very cool which i saw you can see here and now look look at the curve look at the curve look at that look at that look at that look at that Look at that, look at that. Whoa, all the way to the back. Look at this, I love this orange. Also the glass to back. So these are amazing cars, guys. And The more you look after the car, the more the car is going to look after you. But this, I'm telling you, the, mom, the moment you sit in the seats, every other car will look like average. These seats are something else. So now I'm going to demonstrate the same. Close the door. You don't want the battery to run out. Because I love the slide so much. And these are xenon lights. This one, you can see daytime lights, nighttime lights. You can see them. BMW made so many variations, but I think these are the best because there's less to go wrong. And also, not any other car can match them. Because you put everything together. What do you think, guys? Black chrome, normal chrome. Comment below what you would think for me at the moment i'm aiming for power so so now we're going to show you in my the, the horsepower we upgraded we upgraded the system so we, we tune up the alpina dashboard As you can see here the M logo comes in so now you can see this the dials are different so this one 210 miles per hour and when you put it into sport it gets more aggressive more uh, thing. so now the power will come to the power the sport displays 200 horsepower 400 newton meters hopefully soon that going to change so which one you like guys tell me you like this one the comfort or do you like the sport see what the magic happens you see this one look look i just want to demonstrate press this button did you see that <laughs> so BMW 
BMW never disappoints. You come, you see the train on the lights. As soon as you open this, M Sport. Yes? So it means you have something special in your hands. You can see here, this seat, they don't fall, they're firm. That's why they're a little bit more chunky. And also, you have to pay BMW 400 pounds to have them folded. So the owner who had it before me, they never paid the, the excess for the seats to fold. So I'm stuck with, so now, these cars, we are a team, the best minicab team in the, not London, <laughs> who runs around in BMW M Sports. You can see it, the lights here. As long as you don't press it, they stay on. same you see this is two piece you can see the co different color you can see this one different than this that one is all one but the same 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 uh, diamond shape exhaust and these are real it's got double flaps double flaps in the turbo and double flaps in each exhaust. You can see. Good. This is what I wanted to do a full review because you get to know which is the G31 and G30 5 series, the best cars you can buy, value for money. So, another thing left to do is. But we know what we do best. We have this Fast and the Furious ready. The only thing left to do is have a little race in the future. <laughs> but not today. Because you can see my foot is broken. And I keep walking like a... We don't want any more broken <laughs> broken bones. If you, if you like this video, press the thumbs up, like, subscribe. And if you want to see more videos, and if you want to see the race, let us know. From me and the BMs and my friend who I thank him for sharing his uh, beloved, lovely BMW 5 Series for the channel contribution so we can have more videos like this and I, I can do what I love with cars and show my, my, my hobby. So if you like this video, uh, like I said, I've done all my best, thank you very much and see you next time.